TVXQ and who's currently under investigations by the police for having floated South Korea level 2 social distancing rules. And since mid-February, South Korea stepped up the social distancing measures to level 2, and level 2 restaurants and other public establishments are required to close at 10 p.m. daily. People also are allowed to gather in groups of less than 5 people. And according to the police, Yunho was caught at a restaurant at Chunnamdong past 10 p.m. until about midnight late last month, as he had floated the restrictions he's currently under investigations. Also, SM Entertainment has responded with an official statement. They acknowledged his mistake and shared that Yunho is reflecting deeply in his mistake. They apologize for having alarmed everyone during tough times and promised to make better efforts to educate their artists better. Actress Lee Jun, who was known for being in the popular 19 k drama Light of the Youth, had passed away at the age of 52. According to the police, she was found dead in her home in Seoul on March 8, around 8 p.m. KST. Police revealed were received a call from an acquaintance who said they could not contact her. She had been living alone after her son left to enlist in the military. Police will be holding an autopsy to determine the exact cause of this. On March 9, the Daegu Central District Court found singer Wisong guilty of illegal habitual propofol use. As a result, Wisong has been sentenced to one year in prison if he violates any additional laws during a probationary period of two years. As you know, he was previously indicted for his habitual use of the illegal anesthetic propofol in August of last year. Then, in January, during his initial court hearing, Wisong pleaded guilty to his charges and stated that he was reflecting on his actions.